August Lean Hogs had a big reversal higher after setting a new fresh contract low earlier in the day, settling up $2 on the day. So that was actually a pretty nice reversal higher day for the Lean Hogs. Some people would be looking at that as a potential of the beginning of the bottoming process for the Hogs. Uh, we shall see. However, we did not close the gap when we gapped lower on Wednesday. That would have been the icing on the cake if we were able to do that possibly maybe looking to do that uh, before the end of the week. So we shall see if that happens or not. From a fundamental standpoint, weights and hogs were up a pound from one week to this, or uh, since last week. But more concerning, uh, you've got at the average hog weight about five pounds heavier than it, it, it has been on the five-year average. So we have some very heavy hogs up front. And even if we don't have uh, quite as many animals, that certainly is uh, represents bigger production. What it also means is that we're holding on to animals a little bit longer, feeding them longer to get those higher, uh, to get the higher uh, average weights, which means that mac marketings uh, or, or hogs going to market is backed up a little bit. Uh, there's a lot of animals uh, up front, uh, which is going to uh, potentially keep some pressure on the market in the short run unless we pun intended, chew through that supply faster than how we have been. So uh, that'll be something to look out for. In the meantime, we had our weekly export sales. They were fairly sluggish. They were down 55% uh, from last week and down 29% from the four-week average at 26.5 thousand metric tons. Still an okay number, uh, but it has been cooling off, and that is a bit of a, a, bit of a concern. So Lots going on in the hogs market. Everybody stay tuned. Have a wonderful day and stay safe.